Thanks for tuning in to Anubis Tech Talk. I have the lights dim so that you can see the screen better. So let's get started. As you hit the home button, you immediately see a change. And you can slide anywhere now to activate the screen. And I love how the apps just fly onto the screen. It's very beautiful the way they did that. And as you can see, you slide down, the keyboard shows up. And the keyboard interface is very different from the way it was before. I, I like this way. I like it. It's nice. It's comfortable and active just like any key eye device keyboard would be. Also what's changed is the folders. You no longer have to have multiple folders. I, if you've seen some of my other videos before iOS 7 I had multiple folders for my games but now they all can fit in it in the same folder which is cool I like that uh, another change that I love is the notification drop down as you can see it's tra transparent you can still see the background peeking through it you got uh, right now it's on all you can switch to today or miss information this is this is really smooth the way they designed it also if you swipe up you can get the shortcut settings which is very nice which I can adjust the, the volume, I can adjust the screen brightness as you see I have the screen on the fullest brightness um, I can put on music, bluetooth, airport, I mean switch, get to the camera quicker it's, it's very nice the way they did this interface multitasking now you could hit the home button two times and it will show up all the windows that's open Another way is to swipe up and it will also get to your multitask where you can show all the windows that's open. And if you need to close any, it's just a simple matter of just swiping up. And you touch the screen and it can go to the window there. Now, also new is the wallpapers. The moving wallpapers, not di di not dynamic, <laughs> or you know whatever you want to call it, but they call it dynamic. I Android already had moving wallpapers for a while, but it's cool that um, Apple has it now. And as you see, it's different colors. So uh, let's go to yellow. And as you can see, the bubbles move with the screen, which is cool. Also new with the um with the new iOS is a uh, new different wallpapers that you probably did not see. I like the uh, space ones. Very beautiful. And again, I love the animation how everything just slides right back into place. So is they made it very easy to, to operate with this operating system it's not too much of a difference when it comes to operating it from the other one other than what I'm showing you right now um, you can uh, pull down the apps and place them on top of each other to form a folder if you need to you hit the home button again to stop the shakiness I have two pages but Again, just by holding the apps you and pressing down, you can make another page if you need to, which is real cool, and drag it back just as I did to get it back. Also new, the clock shows the exact time, depending on where you're at, it's going to show the same time, which is really cool. I noticed not all the apps are yet formatted for iOS 7. Um, the only thing I have on here that's not compatible just yet, hopefully it will be when this officially come out next week Wednesday, is uh, my translation app which is a good app. I want to do a video about it and as you can see it open up and then it close right back but so far out of <laughs> the hundreds of apps I have on here that's the only one that is giving me a bit of a problem. 
also new in videos you have the option to uh, put movies on here and also the movies that you already bought or TV shows you already bought will show up on your screen but they won't take up no memory but as long as you're online you can play them how you can tell the ones you have downloaded and ones you don't is it will have the iCloud symbol on it so as you can see some of them have the iCloud symbol symbol some of them don't TV shows are all here they all popped up so if you uh, go to settings and you go to video as you can see I have show all videos on so if I was to turn it off and then go back to videos it changes now it only shows the movies that I put on here not all the movies that I have bought or all the TV shows that I bought but since it's not taking up no memory I mean, I, I know this is a 64 gig iPad, but hey, why not keep all my options open? You know, I might want to see it. And I think that is a really cool feature because, you know, memory issue is an issue. If you buy uh, a device, like uh, some of my friends bought a 16 gig and didn't realize that they will fill it up in a day. So with this feature here, you get to still have your shows and not take up a lot of memory. Also a new cool feature in the um, music store, the, the music store, <laughs> the iTunes, you have the iTunes radio. I haven't set mine up yet, but I think it's cool. So it's giving uh, Pandora some competition. Um, later I will do a review on it once I really sit down and get into it. So overall this is a very good operating system. And I, one of the features that a lot of my friends love about it is that no one can steal it from you. If you um, have a lot of code or if you don't have a lot of code, if they try to reset it, your, your email will show up that you use for your um, iDevice. And they will have to know your password in order to get in it. So there's no way they're going to get to use your iDevice. So pretty much if they stole it or you lost it and someone tried to use it for themselves, it pretty much just became a paperweight. So, yes, I think this is a really good operating system. Um, I can't, I just, I can't wait for them to even upgrade it even more because, you know, this is just, you know, the first, first of, uh, of the, the feature that's, that's coming out. You know, it's eventually they're going to updated and updated and updated like they did with iOS 6 and iOS 5 and all the other ones and I just can't wait to see how much better that this operation system could get but right now is this this is really good I love how it's so bright colorful rich um, as you can see on this retina display you can see the words very clearly um, is this is this beautiful it's definitely eye-catching I mean is I'm just amazed how no matter where I go, people know instantly. Oh, that's iOS 7. Wow, that's out right now. Is this is this great? So um, I hope you enjoyed my video and my little tutorial on uh, iOS 7. Please comment, rate, subscribe, share my video. Peace.